Hi, Hiram here. I'm going to do a test here requested by Drunken Shooter. He wanted me to use that do-it-yourself hot beverage cook set, but instead of using the tea light with the vertical wick, to go back and try try it with that, and please excuse me, the Zabatin stove. I saw this on TZ Stoves videos. Basically it's just a piece of carbon fiber, single layer. I'm going to try another one with a double layer. But it's just a piece of carbon fire, fiber wrapped up in aluminum foil with a small hole cut in it for the flame. In this case the hole is about three quarter of an inch square. So I have one cup of water setting at 61 degrees. Let's light this. Yep. Let's put the water on. One cup starting at 61. And let's see where this goes. There we have 210. 11 212 degrees in nine minutes look like eight seconds that's one cup of water starting at 60 got to 212 in nine minutes and eight seconds let's see how long this will run till burnout okay even though the flame is still burning. I'm going to mark this at 1303 because the top the temperature is dropping on the cup even with a the flame there. Not sure why that happens. But this was a test suggested by Drunken Shooter. Again, it was 1 cup of water starting at 60 degrees came to a boil in 9 minutes and eight seconds the Zabatin burner from TZ stoves is still burning but it's not helping the cup any so I'll figure that it the run out was at 13 minutes and about three seconds and that was on one tablespoon of denatured alcohol the room temperature is 60 degrees and the humidity is 45 percent so a little slow but it gets the job done a little less bulky I guess than having to worry about something like this because what can you do to damage these things I mean you know best thing you have to do is worry about maybe leaking in your kit interesting so again I thank Drunken Shooter for that as always I thank all of you for your suggestions helpful suggestions your questions remarks and let's put this one to bed and watch for my buddy Max.